Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to Saturday Real Chit Chat and shout out. I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, let me tell you a little bit what's going on real quick. I have been sick for over two and a half weeks. Um, short story, I'm not gonna get into everything. My neurologist apparently had over-medicated me. Yep, that's right. Every day I was taking medication and I was over-medicating. It made me sick. I couldn't see, I couldn't walk, I had slurred speech. If you watch my videos, I still can't see very well. I'm doing the best I can. Right now I'm fighting and um, trying to get my, um, I'm getting my speech back. I get a little memory foggy. Um, um, see, I get these fog brains, I can't think. Um, my vision's coming back slowly. Um, I got a lot of side effects that I'm fighting right now to get back. I have an upper respiratory infection in the UTI, so I have a lot going on. This medication has really messed me up. I'm not very happy with my doctor, my urologist. I went for an appointment that I was supposed to be at on Monday. I got there and they said, oh, I'm sorry, he had an emergency, he had to go out of town. Wow, was I upset, not a courtesy call. I've had this man for several years and he's been really great. So I come home, called my primary care doctor, told her what was going on. She said, meet me in my office on Monday. We're taking you off the Topamac, that's what I was on. So this was Tuesday, they started tapering me off the medicine, so I gotta take my glasses off. And um, let's see, I've been Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, today's Friday, four days. So Monday, she's hoping that we'll all be out of my system and they're gonna um, put me on another medication called Poporol or something like that. I'm not sure. Um, Sherry, if you're out there, do you know something about Poporol? I think you might have mentioned it once. Um, so I'm not sure. I still got a lot going on. So that's it for me. That's all I'm going to say about it. That's all I know about it. So still keep me in your prayers. I still got a lot going on. Now, I got friends meal. So excuse me for squinting and all, but it's, um, the light's bothering my eyes. My new glasses are in, but I can't get them until my eyes straightened out. Oh, one more thing. I have numbness in my hands. We thought that was, I can't put these on, they hurt. Um, they thought it was affiliated with um, medication reaction. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Me. But you know what? I'm 64, but I feel like I'm 18. Well, by golly, I'm getting out there next week and I'm gonna start raking. I'm gonna start, hey, my life's not stopping. I want to be active. I got a nice pool out there. I'm going to start, you know, hey, nothing's stopping me. I'm positive. I'm going to go get it. So, the x-ray. My doctor wanted an x-ray. Guess what happened? I wrote it on my hand so I wouldn't forget. I have a bone in my back that slipped forward. Yeah, it slipped forward. C4 and C5. You know what happened? The back of my chair. Maggie May always sits up there. She puts her butt down my head. She bites my hair or she sits here or she sits there. She might have done it. The doctor said she weighs 16 and a half pounds. 16 and a half pounds. Yeah, Maggie Moo may, may have done it. Yippee. So now I have to go to physical therapy. And if that doesn't work, I have to see an orthopedic surgeon. Just, I don't know how it happened. I'm just gonna forget about it now, one day at a time one day at a time. So that's it for that. Guess what? I got friend's mail. Boop, 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 boop. She said I could open it or not, but I'm going to open it. I open everybody else's. Yay. And it's from Granny T. I can't sing like a granddaughter because she's so cute. Annabella. I think that's her name, Annabella. I try to remember everybody's name. Hello. Did you know? Did you know? It's a baby chick. I like them when I had granny chicks. It says, I'm thinking of you. I gotta hold it closer. I'm thinking of you. Hope you have a very happy Easter. Brenda, thank you for being such a wonderful friend. Love, Tammy. Isn't that nice? Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, thank you. 
and she got me this. I, she got my mom one too. And that was so thoughtful of, but I can't go to my mom and dad's because um, Ray's out, out, Ray's work had an outbreak of COVID. Yeah, Ray's work. Six workers, two of them had it, four didn't. Praise God, Ray didn't. A week ago Friday, he called, closed, they had to close work. Four of them had to go get tested. Ray tested negative. They were off until this past Monday. And um, crazy world we're living in. I haven't had the COVID test. My dad doesn't want me going down until I get the COVID test. I don't know. But anyways, it says, your attitude determines your direction. That's right. Have a positive attitude. Ooh, ooh, I have a positive attitude. Oh, yes, I do. And that's a nice, cute bag. I can put vegetables in there. You know what? I think you even could grow potatoes in there because it's nice and aerated. But I'm not going to grow it. I'm going to use it for the grocery store. Oh, yes, I am. Thank you, thank you, Tammy. And I got prayer cards. And it says, inspirational prayers and scripture cards for yourself and others. There's 20 of them. And this one says, prayer, inspirational prayer and scripture cards, yourself and others, 20 of them. I had, I think it was this one. And guess what? You can't guess, can you? Maggie Moo got a hold of them. She took them in a crate and ate them up. Oh, you know what she did today? I thought, oh gosh, Maggie Moo's such a good girl. Oh, she got me the Magnetic Book Marts, Faith, God, and Grace. Oh, I gave some of these away and I wanted some. And I'm like, oh, I really should have kept them for me. Now I got some. Thank you so much. Thank you, Granny T. And guess where Granny T's going? She's going up on my love wall. Thank you, Granny T. All of them. That was so nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And my mom will say thank you, too. Thank you so much. But back to um, Maggie May. She was so quiet. I didn't know what was going on. She bit a hole in her bedding and tore out all the stuff. And that's my Maggie May. I got to move along here. Move along, move along. Okay. <sighs> Yang Yang Strawberry Cream. I think I said that right. I can't read. Crack a stick dip is what I'm going to try. I can't read the back. You're going to have to put a still on it. Sorry, should have had Ray write it down for me. I only can try a little bit. Whoops. Oh, goodness. I dropped my stick here. I got to move along. Get the wall done, too. Oh. I don't know about this. Stomach's so upset. Horse, my neighbor, my neighbor, horse, my neighbor. You get this. I'm the only one going to eat them. It says stag beetle power jaw. Stag beetle power jaw. Oh, this it tastes like a little bit of strawberry. Like glue. I'm not eating it. This pot kind of like an animal cracker. Now, if it was kids, they'd go. It's a cigarette, baby. Cigarette, baby. Cigarette, baby. Nope. Not my cup of tea. Sorry. Ray will, no, Ray can't have it. He's diabetic. Mm -mm. To me, and it could be me because I don't have any taste. 
but we're going on to the wall. Granny T for the shout out. Not up there yet. Now I may not be able to see all, but I'm gonna try. Oh, we got Bandana Grandma. We got Paula Bowie. I'm going by sight. We got Susan Lee. We got my friend Penny. We got Jules and M. We got Cryptid. We got Life of Millwife. We got Vanilla Grandma. We got Bandana Grandma. We got Robin Katan Mama. We got Stacy's Cooking. We've got Work That Crown with Allie and JD. We got the Koopa family. We got Life with Granny T right there. We've got Crystal. We got Life with Lois. We got Sandra's Homespun. We've got Maniac Grammy Brenda. That's me. We got Grampy Campy. We've got Janice from Marie. Uh, from uh, Michigan. We've got Kimmy's Kitchen. We've got Kimmy's Boxes. We've got Amber. We've got Kim Fry and his wife Pam. We've got Greg from Florida, Mudnut um, Drive Shaft Drew, Dolly McFaith, uh, Kimmy's Boxes with the Jelly Bean Peace sign, and we got Rose. All right, that's it, I think. Woohoo! And I apologize if I forgot anybody. <sighs> wow, that took it all out of me. Doesn't take much, I get winded. So I hope everybody has a great day. And I'm doing this on Friday. Sorry about this. But you know, guys, look. This is like, this is like, this is like glue. This, this is really like, look, they're like glue. Well, I think it's called Yang Yang and Yang Yang Strawberry Cream. Fun animal name games on each stick. So have a great day. God bless. And we will see you tomorrow. Oh, happy Easter. We're not celebrating Easter here. Not at all. The only thing Easter on is the things I've been wearing and my Easter scarf. Because I, I haven't felt well enough to do anything. I decided to put some garland up on my tree. No. My son invited me down and I told him, no, nah, my youngest son, Christopher, I can't do it. I'm sorry. I just, just can't. I don't know what I'm going to be like until I get up in the morning, until I hit my floor. Every day is different. So God bless. Happy Easter. Enjoy your family and friends. And do what you got to do on Easter. I love you. And that's what I got to say. Have a great day. God bless. Bye now. Stay safe, happy, and friendly.